Packing the mail, it's gone. Uh, she like I smell cologne. Yeah, I just signed a deal, I'm on. Yeah, yeah. I go where I want, good, good. Play if you want, let's do it. Huh. I'm a young CEO, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. ESPN, man. Do me one favor, please. Just one, man. I just need one small favor, man. Get Ryan Holland's ass off TV, please. Get his ass off TV, man. He does not need to be talking basketball. His basketball card is gone. I'm officially taking his basketball card. I don't want to hear shit about Ryan Hollis anymore. I'm officially taking this dude basketball card. Fire this man ASAP. ASAP. Get him off TV, man. This dude is a disgrace, man. He's sitting up here as a former NBA player. Who was garbage, by the way. Who was boo-boo, by the way. Sitting up here saying Ben Simmons deserves a five-year, $170 million deal. And the dude can't even shoot a jump shot. The dude can't even lead his team at least to the Eastern Conference Finals. Are you serious? Are you serious, Ryan Hollins? Are you serious? You going to sit on national TV and make that statement? Have you seen Ben Simmons in the playoffs? Are you serious? I don't even know why I watch these shows in the morning, man. I don't even know, man. I'm just going to give up, man. I'm just going to give up. I'm going to stop watching these shows in the morning, man. This is getting ridiculous, man. Now you got former NBA players coming on. The only thing that I agree with Ryan Hollins about is LeBron is the GOAT. That's the only thing. But this dude got the nerve to sit on national TV and say that. Ben Simmons. Do y'all know how many point guards is better than Ben Simmons? Do y'all think Ben Simmons deserves a max deal? Like Kyrie Irving? Like Russell Westbrook? Like Chris Paul? Because Chris Paul's proven, even though he's on a decline. Steph Curry? Are you serious? Kimball Walker? He's not on his level? Are you serious? Now, maybe later down the road, he deserves a max contract. If he can develop. I'm not into... If I'm an owner, I'm not into playing. I'm not into paying players what the market says they should get. I don't care how much money the NBA brings in. I'm not gonna pay no scrub. I'm not paying no scrub. I'm not paying no scrub that don't even want to take a jump shot. I'm not paying no scrub that that can't even be aggressive in the playoffs. So you paying this dude $170 million over five years to go pass the ball and go stand in the corner. Who ain't going to even attempt to be aggressive. Not even going to attempt. No attempts. And Ryan Hollins, a former NBA player who played the game, who supposedly studied the game, going to sit on national TV and say Ben Simmons deserves that contract at his young age right now. Like I said, maybe later down the road, but now, get your ass off TV talking that nonsense. Get your Rudy Pooh candy ass off TV. Shout out to The Rock. Get your candy ass off TV talking that basketball, man. ESPN, fire this man ASAP, man. And Max Kellerman, man. I got to give you your basketball card back, man. You lost it with me. But I got to give you your basketball card back. Max Kellerman said to, when he was debating uh, Ryan Hollins, he said, if they're going to pay Ben Simmons all that money, they need to surround him with shooters and they need to trade Joel Embiid because they don't they don't mesh well. Because Joel Embiid, he's a he's a dominant post player and he's going to demand touches. Right. 
and he's going to clog up the paint. If you keep Joel Embiid there, he's going to clog up the paint, and Ben Simmons won't have any driving lanes since he can't shoot. So if a player – if look at Giannis. Like, like Max Kellerman said, he said Giannis is a player who can't shoot yet. But they surrounded him with shooters, so it gives him driving lanes for him to kick out the shooters. So if you're going to pay Ben Simmons all that money, you might as well trade Joel Embiid and just surround Ben Simmons with shooters like Giannis. That was a great point, Max Kellerman. I see you've been watching the Easy Work Sports Talk channel. I see you've been watching me, man. Go on national TV and admit it on ESPN. You won't, though. <laughs> he won't. He won't say he was watching me. But he's been watching me. He been listening. I'm going to reward you. I'm going to give your basketball card back, man. But Ryan Hollins, your basketball card, man. You will have to, man, you will have to put a lot of work in to get that basketball card back. Lord, have mercy. This dude talking nonsense early this damn morning, man. I'm on the road listening to this nonsense. Get your ass off TV, Ryan Hollins. You better study the game. I speak nothing but facts on my channel. We not hiding. We not running from nobody. Easy work squad, man. Stand up. Like, comment, subscribe to the content, man. And share this video. And if you're new to the channel, hit that, sub hit that subscribe button, man. Get your ass off TV, Ryan Hollins. No shit about basketball, man. The hell wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? I'm gone.